picture here is the uh, subframe mount on the driver's side. This section in here where you see my finger is actually supposed to be up inside the mount, which is up in the uh, frame rail itself. So this engine is actually dropping about two and a half inches, so the whole subframe is coming down. So those definitely need to be replaced. Go over to the other side, show you the same on the other mount. You can see the space there also. This is the inside of the mount, which is supposed to be up in there, so this gap is supposed to be smaller. The engine's actually uh, dropping with the subframe about two and a half inches. Um, the left front brake caliper is seized. Um, I cannot push the pistons back to get the uh, to get the pads back. And as you can see, I can't turn the brake rotor by hand, or barely can turn it. Um, so the calipers um, need to be replaced in the front. I would recommend doing the driver's side also because it is original, and the uh, and because of the age difference, one new one and one old one, the brakes uh, will definitely not stop correctly. Um, because the condition of the passenger side one, and because of its color, um, it's gotten hot. You can see how shiny it is, and you can see the tints of blue. Um, it shows you how hot it did get. It's probably warped. It does not feel straight to me um, any longer. I can run my hand over it and feel differences in the metal. Uh, so I would definitely replace the front rotors also.